on the surface, I'd, I'd love it if people just walk away feeling like they've had just a little bit of joy in their day or they've seen something that was um, fun or playful. The title of the folly is Family Values. That relates to sort of our concept around crafting and how those skills are passed through families and um, also about the sort of structure of the folly itself as the three objects of the looms standing in space create a little family of looms. I think a particular challenge of family values and its construction was to build something that is traditionally not built like this. We have woven every element together as if you were creating a loom and creating a fabric and that is the essence of the design and typical construction. That is not the way you normally do things. This was probably the most challenging entry, wasn't it? The most unusual, for all sorts of reasons. That the work itself was alluding to feminist politics and the group of women were scattered between a couple of cities and so all of those things added up to be a real challenge for the project. And I think the other thing that's really important is that the completed piece creates a space within it and, you know, the debate is always in what way is a folly different from a piece of sculpture? I think the point that's been made clearly is that it's the ability to create space that one can step inside it or move around it and have some transformation of that which you're looking out at. I can see the industry really opening up and allowing more women to express themselves or allowing more gender diverse people to express themselves. We can see a lot more diversity in the things that we build, not only in the offices and the people that build them, but the ideas that are able to be expressed. It's about being confident, being bold, and I think that we've achieved that. So the three stages of creating a woven fabric are threading the warp, then weaving the weft, and then the final product is the work, or referred to as the worked fabric. Um, each of the looms represents each stage, so the one down the hill that has only verticals is the warp of the loom, weft, and then work is a slightly lower, slightly uh, more wizened in a way. We um, like the idea that there's sort of a conversation between the three elements where they're passing on knowledge between each other and playing on the complexities of learning a craft and then passing it on to keep increasing your knowledge. As a team, we've achieved a really strong outcome in that what we see at Broke Bay today is entirely true to what we submitted in the design at the very initial stages and absolutely true to our design values throughout the process.